The comedian does a little bit of everything. He's wasted no time stepping out of the shadow of legendary comedian and brother Chris Rock with films like Think Like a Man. And he's now playing the character Vince in the new CBS comedy, Living Biblically. You watch it on Local 12. And uh, Tony's making a stop at the Liberty Funny Bone this weekend. He joins us now. Thanks so much for dropping by so early, man. Yeah, great to see you. Thanks, Tony. Yeah, so right. right. So, uh, so how, how, how is the, the sh uh, work, working on the show? It's, it's a lot of fun. It's uh, You know, the, the, the show is based on a, a real book. It's uh, The yeah. Year of Living Biblically that uh, A.J. Jacobs wrote. He tried to live his life one calendar year, 100% according to the Bible. Whew. In the sitcom, uh, the lead character, Chip, tries to live his life 100% uh, according to the Bible until his child is born. He finds out his wife is pregnant. Okay. And he just wants to be a better person until the baby comes. Yeah. That, that sets up all kinds of wonderful possibilities. Exactly. Right. Right. In, in, yeah. in terms right. of comedic possibilities. But you get to do things like that where you're, you know, you're making a sitcom, but you're also up in front of people, making people laugh. What, what do you like doing better? You like a live crowd out uh, there? Yeah, you stand like up. The stand up yeah, comes first. I had a stand up is the first love, but stand up makes everything else possible. Once you kind of get good at stand up, yeah. some other doors open in, in the, in the entertainment industry so I'm just yeah. happy to take advantage of all of them that's awesome so, yeah. is it stand up is it the give and the take being in the moment what uh, so I create it all I'm the writer producer yeah. director uh, I'm in front of the camera I'm behind the camera I am the creative voice I'm it's all me and then and the aspect of being in front of people and yeah. getting the immediate response from people with you know the material you created right anymore it seems like to, to be successful you kind of have to be able to yeah. do a little oh, bit of everything anytime absolutely. it seems like we have you know a comedian come through they're they got their hands in a little bit of this yeah. and a little bit of that yeah. the more successful guys are the guys that know how to play the game not the game but know how to no, yeah. you know put their their uh get their shel the shelving ready. Like you, you're on this sure. level, then the next level is going to take a different you, and the next level is going to take a different like you in advancement. Yeah. So the, the, the more successful guys, if you look at any comic that has been really successful, they know how to produce, they know how to write, they know how to direct, they know how to you know create. And you got your hands in a lot of stuff. Uh, was it easier or more difficult for you to be able to establish your own world, your own credentials uh, with, your, with the success of your, your older brother, Chris? Uh, uh, it's double-edged sword. Double yeah. sword. You know, comedically, people uh, sometimes people come to my shows because it, it's Chris's brother, and then they want to see. They see once you see me do stand up, it's like oh, okay, he has his own voice. Right. He's right. he's not his brother. It, you know, and it depends on which, which one you kind of like. You know, you take your sure. pick yeah. your poison. What <laughs> what do people see when they come see you? What what kind of things do you like to talk about? Yourself? Uh, I talk about everything. It's like I call my show a conversation with Tony Rock because I whatever's going on in the room. Uh, pop culture, sports, you know, everything across the board. I'm, I'm a reporter. I'm, I'm like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's cool. Yeah. No, I like so, that. So what's making you laugh today? Uh, today? What's making me laugh? Uh, you know what? I, when, you, when you talk about relationships on stage, it's still the most fun because yeah. the, it encompasses the most oh, yeah. of the room. So they're either going through it, exactly what you're talking about, they're fastly approaching what you're talking about, <laughs> or they just survived what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. So you get the majority of the room when you talk about relationships. That's why yeah. all comics do it. How, how many shows are you going to be doing this weekend? Uh, we started last night. Great show okay. last night. We have two tonight, two tomorrow, one Sunday. Awesome. All right. Well, it's a pleasure. Oh, so much, so much fun. Thanks so much. Thanks for coming Thank in, man. Much. I know, I know it's awfully early for you when yeah. you're out doing the show last comic, night. I'm a comic, man. I didn't even go to bed yet. Yeah, just keep <laughs> on pushing through. Yeah. Keep on pushing through. Tony Rock, we appreciate it. Thank we'll get more so information much. about the shows up yes. on our website, local12.com. Thanks right. so much. Thank you so much.